Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been two months exactly. About, yeah, because it's like July 13th now. It, it took me a second. I've lost track of the days. And the last video I filmed was May 14th. So yeah, it's been a hot minute. So basically this is just a life update because Again, I have nothing better to do, and it took me two months to come up with anything interesting enough to talk about. So that's about how interesting my life is, and yeah. So, after my last video, I finished up my IB tests, graduated. That was weird. That happened. <laughs> I'm getting closer to being an adult. I'm still 17, but... Get in there. I'm, I'm getting there, and it's kind of kicking my butt right now because I really want to be 18 for a lot of things. Because <laughs> I'm kind of tired of not being able to sign my own papers for school, especially. <laughs> Anyways, so I finished up all my IB tests, had my graduation party. That was fun, I guess. I don't. It was fine. <laughs> I don't. I've never been to parties. I've never thrown one. So that was probably the most effort I've put into a party, but it's still just... It was fun. It was nice, because we just we just hung out, watched a couple movies. They were kind of weird. Watched Megamind. Megamind's the best movie ever. <laughs> yeah, so graduation party was pretty nice. And... Then, that, the Monday after my graduation party is when I started my new job. So, thank God I do not work at Taco Bell anymore. So now I'm, I've moved up in the world and I work at Panera. It's, it's at least a little, little more expensive so I get better customers <laughs> and don't have to deal with people complaining about $1 tacos. But, well, I guess you can't even get tacos for a dollar because they're like $3 now, but... Still, much better time at Panera. <laughs> and let's see. So I started that job. And at first I wasn't working too often. Like it was like a few days a week. It wasn't too bad. I've never really had a full-time job until now. Just because I've been in school. And then, yeah, so I've never worked more than like 25-ish hours a week until now so now I'm doing at least 38 and then it gets up to 40 eventually because I always have to stay late for stuff but yeah so that's why I haven't filmed anything in a couple months because <laughs> I'm yeah I've been working quite a bit I had a couple of things at college which I'll talk about because I don't literally nothing has happened other than those <laughs> so I had my what it's called cardinal day Anyway, so I went and got my ID, did a campus tour, ate some ate some of the cafeteria food. It's pretty good. Uh, um Yeah, so that day wasn't super eventful other than driving six hours. I mean it's three hours there, three hours back, but it's still like and that time was still with my mom. But on the next time um, I went there to, it, it was basically just so like, so you can meet people and meet your, like, hopefully meet your new roommate, because then it allows you to, like, pick your roommate, rather than just be randomly assigned, and, like, it's really nice that they do that, I know, like, like I'm going to a small private college, that's what it's called, it's college, uh, <laughs> And so, like, there are only, like, 900 kids total. So it's easier to just set set stuff up like that. So then people can, like, meet each other and be like, Oh, you want to be roommates? Cool. Anyway, so I did that. Um, and we stayed, and we had to stay the night. And, yeah, so that was, that was super fun. And I met this one girl that we decided to be roommates. And at the end, we went and, like, picked out which dorm we wanted. And, like... Yeah, so she's super cool, and I met a couple other girls that I'm definitely going to end up hanging out with all the time. So I'm really hoping we got dorms near each other. 
so yeah, I'm I'm very happy with that and how that all went. We went to um, a world of fun. That was fun. That was the first time I went, and that was the first time I went, and those were probably the <laughs> most intense rides I've been on. Which may or may not be saying something. I don't know. I was so tired because <laughs> I just oh I I completely passed by. The week before that, I was in Florida with my boyfriend and his parents, and that was so nice. I've, I'd never really gone on, like, a real vacation before that. <sighs> I needed it. I needed that week. <laughs> it was so fun, and, like, I just got to relax for once and just chill and not go visit random family members that I haven't seen since I was, like, two then they'll be like, oh, you've gotten so big. And it's like, yeah, I haven't seen you in 16 years and I have no clue who you are. <laughs> so, like, I keep playing with my hair. It's because I'm actually, like, I'm just using the front camera on my phone because I got a new phone and it's actually able to do that with decent quality. And so, like, I'm actually watching myself talk and I keep fixing my hair. Because <laughs> I had it in a middle part this morning because I... I had little pigtails for work because I'm trying to look cute at work for no reason, but... Oh well, I tell people that they look cute all the time because people that come to Panera are like super trendy and hipster and cute and I just can't help it. <laughs> Where was I? Oh yeah, so I got back from Florida, went to the little orientation thing with the, the roommates. And that was all in the span of, like, eight days. <laughs> and, like, I got a kidney infection in the middle of that somewhere. And so I had to miss work for the one day that I was home before I went back to the college. <laughs> but, yeah, so... That was fun. I'm fine now, by the way. But... <sighs> Where am I at in my life? What have I done in the past month? worked. I worked a lot. Um, on my days off, I don't really do anything. I usually just use them as days off and sleep or play uh, my 3DS. Or actually, it's my boyfriend's 3DS. It's not mine. But yeah, so I think, I think we're pretty much, oh wait, I, I did get the IB diploma. I got that. I got the scores back for it a couple weeks ago. I barely got it, but I got it. <laughs> I made just enough points <laughs> to be able to get it. <laughs> because like, you, you have to have 24, I had 25. I did it. You know, I, I spent the two years, I tried, I did it. <laughs> okay, we can stop talking about it now. I got it. <laughs> Um, I did not get a high enough score to be able to be in the, like, the higher, um, psychology class at my school, but I was already signed up for the higher psychology class at my school, and so whenever I got the score back, I was like, crap, I don't have the requirements to be in this class, so I went back to try and change it to the intro class, it was full. So I stressed out for a solid like two hours waiting to hear from my guidance counselor about what to do <laughs> because like I, I couldn't do anything like on online by myself to like fix my schedule because like I was like oh maybe I can just move this math class around so that I can fit into this psychology class. No, it, it would not, it would not work. <laughs> So yeah, I, I emailed my guidance counselor, got a response then like pretty quickly the next the next day because I emailed him at like eleven or something. <laughs> this is another reason I'm tired is because I stay up late and still get up at five. <laughs> but yeah, and so he responded. He's like, okay, I'll I'll talk to these people that are the heads of the departments, and I was like. Ugh. <laughs> And then he emailed me again, like, a couple hours later. I was like, okay, they, they had a conversation, and since you had good grades and you did IB psychology, then you can stay in the higher class. And I've, 
<gasps> I'm just so happy because I don't have to change my schedule now. What is this? <laughs> I need to stop touching my hair. <laughs> That's a struggle. <sighs> yeah, and so I don't have to change my schedule for this semester, but I do have to do the intro class at some point just as part of the requirements for the, my major, but yeah, so <laughs> that worked out nicely. Um, I got the room assignment for me and my roommate. We got into the dorm that we wanted, so I'm very happy about that because I definitely wanted the, <laughs> the, the dorms with the bigger rooms. I don't care if it has older bathrooms. I don't some people have like such a problem with the bathroom. No, I'm barely, I'm like all the freshman dorms have community bathrooms at my school, but like I'm barely gonna be in the bathroom because I don't wanna be in there if I don't have to. So like I'll be in there for showers and for you know. So that's what you're getting. Because, like, I can just get a little mirror with lights on it to do my makeup on at my desk in my room in the privacy of me and, I guess, my roommate. But, like, <laughs> I hate it when people, like, watch me do my makeup, even though, like, I, I don't mind doing, like, videos or something. I just feel like they're judging me the entire time, like, oh, are you gonna put mascara on? Oh, you care about what you look like. How dare you? I don't know, it's just like, <laughs> I mean, like, eventually, I think I'll probably get comfortable enough to where I'm just gonna get up, like, 10, 15 minutes before I have to be at a class and just run there. Or maybe get up a little bit earlier so, do I, so I don't have to run. We'll figure it out. Yeah, and, and so I'm, I was very happy that I got into the dorms I wanted. And, oh, I have, I had to go to a little, like, workshop conference thingy for the big scholarship that I'm getting. And so that was, that was actually, like, really interesting because the people that, that got the scholarship were so similar to me, obviously, because it, we all had to meet a certain criteria, like, like low income, uh, good grades, be involved in other things, work, because like you have to work like 240 hours a year, which is not bad. <laughs> and like I beat that, like I think all of us passed up that requirement like really quickly because that's like six weeks working full time. The entire time it was just like them actually giving us tips and like things that are very helpful for actually like getting through college because like they had someone come in that was a professional like personal finance person and like he um did a whole presentation on like budgeting and um making sure you're not overworking yourself but you can work a little bit just so that you like still have some income you don't have to have like a full-time job and be a full-time student or something like that and like, it was just very nice to like, have all of my like anxieties about things be like, acceptable, <laughs> I guess. Because like, with, with the scholarship, you have to meet certain requirements every semester. And like, they were just very realistic about it, I guess. And they were like, just plan your time out. Like, and they gave us ideas for that. And, um, making sure that we have everything organized, making sure we take time to like rest ourselves so that we can be getting better grades and like actually taking time to have fun because that's, that's a big part of college. <laughs> and like they were actually being realistic about it rather than just them just being like, yes, good, good grades and have no time for fun, always be studying, never sleep. <laughs> Like, it, it was really cool. And, like, uh, and they also, like, gave, yeah, they gave everyone a um, $1,000 gift card for Amazon to actually buy dorm stuff, which is super helpful considering all of us are, like, our requirements are that we're low income. So 
that's gonna be super helpful I'm waiting for prime day for that one <laughs> to like order all of my stuff on Amazon and I'm still spending over a thousand because I'm buying a laptop as well but or like I'm not even spending over a thousand I'm spending like 500 on because it's like 1500 total I think in my cart right now because I'm extra and I've planned everything like that for no reason well I mean there is a reason because then I don't have to like t spend the entire day on prime day ordering all of my stuff <laughs> and I can just go in and order it but <laughs> my room is a mess that's one thing that you can yeah you can't see my floor I know you probably didn't notice that until now but yeah you cannot see my floor I mean there's like a little area that's clean like right through here but like all of that is just uh, I need to figure out how I'm gonna actually pack clothes like I think I'll have plenty of room with what the college gives me because like I don't I wear like the same five outfits every or like same seven outfits every week I don't I try to avoid wearing the same one twice in two weeks or in a week hey it's not that bad though because I know some people that try to not wear the same outfit twice in a month so I'm not that extra bad. and right now my boyfriend is at some college camp thing which sounds really cool and I want to be there but they don't accept seniors and it would have been money <sighs> I'm angry because I really wanted to go to that but I'm going to go with his mom to pick him up at the airport and she's gonna take me dorm shopping so I'm excited for that because that's where I'm gonna get like all my decorations and stuff and like my bedding because I do not want to buy that online because I don't trust anything <laughs> so like basically all the stuff that I'm getting on Amazon is gonna be like coffee maker, uh, microwave, and I'll probably make, hopefully if I have time or like think about it or have energy for it, <laughs> I'll, um, go make, I'll make a video about, um, all the stuff that I'm bringing and everything that I ordered on Amazon just to have another video, I guess, and show you guys because for some reason, maybe some of you are interested in my life. I don't know but yeah so I'll make a video of that and yeah I'm very happy and I'll probably make a video while I'm buying stuff buying stuff on Amazon because I know my list is going to expand <laughs> so yeah fun times it is a life that we are living right now so basically my life right now is I'm working for another three and a half weeks I'm taking off the yeah, I'm, I'm quitting a week before I move in, just so, like, I have time to make sure I have everything packed, and just a few days to chill before I'm stressed out for a little bit, trying to get everything moved in, and, like, adjusting to an entirely new life. <laughs> so, I'll try to do a dorm move-in vlog. I really want to, but at the same time, I know I'm super awkward, and my parents would judge me <laughs> so we'll see maybe I'll maybe I'll do um a video on the way up because I'm bringing my boyfriend so anyways so that's me I hope your summer is going pretty well hopefully I'll be able to update a couple more times or like a little more often I'll, I'll maybe try to do it once a week I just had a little more energy today since I got to sleep in because like I'm off work by two every day so I have time I'm just usually really tired and I can't think of anything to talk about but anyways thank you guys for watching you're super cool I love you you're great I'm just dragging this out and making it more awkward than it needs to be so bye but, um, <laughs> sorry, I just closed my drawer. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's a struggle.
I was like, <laughs> been eating a lot of pistachios. What face did I just? What face am I making? <laughs> 